Hello, this is Oklahoma Cannabis Business Attorney Jesse Kovach with the OK Cannabis Law Office. Today we're going to be talking about testing for heavy metals. Now there are certain allowable thresholds for heavy metals that, um, that you have to pass with every harvest batch. Every harvest batch has to be tested. And basically these thresholds are different depending on what kind of product you're talking about. So if you're talking about an inhaled product that is um, administered by metered dose nasal spray or a pressurized metered dose inhaler kind of product, those are gonna have four different um, heavy metals that you heavy metal analytes that you need to test for. And those are gonna be arsenic, which needs to be less than 0.2 parts per million, cadmium, which needs to be less than 0.2 parts per million, lead, which needs to be less than 0.5 parts per million, and mercury, which must be less than 0.1 parts per million. Now, there are different thresholds for topical and transdermal medical products, and those are gonna be um, arsenic must be less than three parts per million, cadmium must be less than three parts per million, lead must be less than 10 parts per million, and mercury must be less than one parts per million. Finally, you have products that are for oral consumption, rectal or vaginal administration, these are typically going to be your suppositories and your um, edibles. These need to be tested for heavy metal analytes, and these thresholds are as follows. So you need to have arsenic at less than 1.5 parts per million, cadmium at less than 0.5 parts per million, lead at less than 1 parts per million, and mercury at less than 1.5 parts per million. Now, if this information was helpful to you and you want to find more like it, you can find more at our website, oklahomamedicalmarijuana.attorney.